Hello, Leos. This is Barb at Mystic Door Tarot. Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you are new to my channel, welcome. Now, this is going to be a very special tarot card reading, as this is what I'm calling a Four Seasons Spread. We're starting off with the winter solstice, going into the spring equinox, summer solstice, and then the fall equinox. This is a five card spread with the center being the best season for Leo's year ahead. And keep in mind, Leo, this is a general reading. So I'm picking up Leo's energy in general. Okay, let's get started. First card, winter solstice. So what's going on this winter season? And you have the nine of cups. So definitely, this is a wish fulfillment card. It's going to be a sense of great satisfaction, uh, maybe getting one or more of what you're looking for, hoping for, wishing for, just feeling really good. Can also be an indication of overindulgence, and that certainly can happen with the holidays coming up. This reading starting on the winter solstice, December 21st, but here with a seasonal look at what the Nine of Cups represents is that not necessarily right now is your wish happening. Nine of Cups represents the time period of March 1st through the 10th. So with this card turning up in your winter season position, something that you do during this time in winter is going to really pay off in the beginning of March. So let's pull a quick clarifying card, see what information we get. Okay, we've got the Three of Pentacles. Well, it's in regards to the work that you do or possibly a hobby that you do. And the timing with this clarifying card is indicating that specifically what you do from December 31st through January 9th during this winter season, you're going to then end up getting your wish in March. So it's kind of like planting the seeds right now and it's going to emerge during those first weeks of March. Next, the spring equinox. So what's coming up or sprouting or emerging in spring? And you have the three of cups. Celebrating some kind of achievement, maybe rewards for all your hard work, certainly can be referring to what you started here or planted in winter is now coming to fruition. With it being the Three of Cups, it can be something in regards to communication. So it can be how you express yourself. This card's ruled by Mercury. And with it being that number three energy, something's coming together to create something new for you, Leo. And the timing here with the Three of Cups showing up in spring is an indication that something or what you're celebrating now is actually really going to take root in July, specifically July 2nd through the 11th. So let's pull a quick clarifying card, see what information we get. The Two of Wands. Something in regards to your future. And the timing with this clarifying card is indicating that somewhere around the week of March 21st through the 30th, something's happening in the spring, like making a decision, kind of making a choice. It's a very creative time for you, Leo. And there's an opportunity here, actually more than one, that you're going to be making a decision about. And that could be taking place March 21st through the 30th. Now next, the summer solstice. So what's going on for the summer months, Leo? There's an indication here of getting recognition, rewards coming in at this time. And you receive the Ace of Wands. 
So the timing of the Ace of Wands showing up in summer is an indication there's an immediate opportunity being put right in front of you. This could be like a burst of creative energy, some inspiration, a new idea, Leo, but very much a very exciting, enthusiastic energy. And this is certainly your time to shine because this is your time, Leo, summer. So it could be some kind of opportunity where you're going to be able to be creative and uh, be able to express your enthusiasm. And that can be in the work that you do. So it is something that is presenting itself during the summer months. It shows up almost immediately in summer. So let's pull a clarifying card for more information. And as I'm looking at the card here, I'm seeing in the background, I see the castle in the background. So some of you might be moving, maybe getting a new home. Major Arcana card strength. This is your card, Leo. And the time element to the strength card is July 22nd through August 22nd. So there might be some kind of opportunity where you're moving. The opportunity could be in regards to the work that you do, could be the company you work for. And you might be taking advantage of possibly a new position or even a new company. And that's going to be taking place anywhere between July 22nd through August 22nd. Certainly your season where you are at your absolute best. Now, the last being the fall equinox. What has really worked well and what will continue to flourish in your life, Leo? You have the Eight of Wands. Now, the Eight of Wands is communication, some kind of messages, information, something that's coming in at like a breaking speed. Whatever this is coming in, Leo, the timing with the Eight of Wands is November 25th through December 2nd. The number eight energy of this card is abundance. So for some of you, you might be going into a leadership role. You might be in a position where you're very influential. And that's how the abundance is going to come through. There could be financial gain through whatever this communication, this information brings in with this eight of wands. Really exciting. So of course... Yes, let's pull a clarifying card for more information. The Four of Wands. Four of Wands is some kind of celebration, some kind of achievement. For some Leos, this is getting engaged because the Four of Wands represents like a time frame of like April 11th through the 20th. So it could be within that time frame a wedding date is set. And remember, this is taking place in fall when maybe the engagement would be happening, but the wedding date might be in April. Now for other Leos, I'm picking up that the information or what's being presented to you with this Eight of Wands, and again, which is in fall, could be an indication that you might be looking for a new home. And the Four of Wands time frame of April 11th through the 20th could actually be the time frame where you're finding a home or closing on the home, kind of making it final. And with this being the number four energy, it's something that's very rock solid, something that you're putting in place. So it's security, whether it's getting married or buying a new home, this is a big deal. So Leo, be looking for what this Ace of Wands is bringing into you in the fall. And again, this timeline is November 25th through December 2nd. Okay. Now, of course, our center card. What will be the best season in the year ahead for Leo? And let me just move the cards to kind of dig it out here. Okay, the Four of Pentacles, Leo. Pentacles are the winter season. So here you go. Four of Pentacles specifically 
is January 10th through the 19th. If we go back to your winter card here, your Nine of Cups, the Wish Fulfillment card, that is specifically the time frame of December 31st through January 9th. That's where you're planting the seeds. That's kind of getting like the whole ball rolling. And now that we've looked at all the different seasons, so what happens during that time frame sets everything in motion. And the Four of Pentacles is security, financial security, and possibly whatever you're doing up until this time frame, up until January 9th. Now, going into the Four of Pentacles time frame is about saving being cautious, protecting your resources, staying put exactly where you're at, and just let your seasons play out as your cards are indicating. So, yeah, hands down, winter is going to be your best season as that is what's going to set something in motion, which is going to be extremely financially beneficial to you in the upcoming year ahead, Leo. And of course, yes, pulling a clarifying card for your best season. Okay. And once again, we get the Three of Cups. This is a time for celebration. Thank you so much for joining me today, Leo. Please be sure to subscribe and help support my channel. And for a private tarot card reading, the links are listed below. And in January, I will be adding the Four Seasons Tarot Spread reading to the readings that are available on my website. Love and abundance to my Leo family.